I'm Carolyn Slavin. I'm the bilingual librarian at Reed Elementary. I'm out in the Cherry Hollow neighborhood. It's a very rural, remote area. Most of these students go to our school at Reed because of our dual language program. When I was able to communicate with a bunch of families, I started hearing all about um, these connectivity issues. It's far out and remote and there aren't any internet cables that come out this far. I've been trying to drive around with the hotspot to just confirm that it's going to work. There's valleys and mountains and kind of different areas where the cell service isn't that great at times. Solamente un teléfono ya que soy la única que está en casa y pues durante el tiempo, las horas que ellos dedicaban a hacer su tarea, yo no puedo usar el teléfono para nada. Estos primeros días ha estado pues ansiosos, tristes, llorando, no pueden uh, conectarse, es, es mucho problema, es muy, muy desgastante como padres y como alumnos. Just looking at the needs in the community that's unique to COVID. And as um, we were seeing it become evident that we're not going to be able to at least start school with kids in seats, that we started asking the question, how many of our kids don't have access to equipment, laptops, or internet, that was a need of about $45,000. So Hill Country was excited that we were able to contribute the first third of that for $15,000 to help uh, LEAF and LISD to make sure every student has access. Being able to access the internet at home is crucially important, again, to, to create that digital equity. It can improve research skills, it increases engagement, it sets them up for the future. And so that is something that LEAF wants to be able to do into the future. We're hoping that this program continues and it doesn't just, just help during the pandemic. It's pandemic and beyond. <laughs> Felices y contentos, menos frustración, están más activos, que pueden terminar toda la clase sin que los esté votando. Nuestro ángel, ah, ah, sinceramente, porque ha traído libros a nuestros hijos, ha estado preocupado por su estabilidad emocional. Estamos muy agradecidos con ella, ah, porque pues gracias a ella, a su a venir hasta acá, su esfuerzo, tiempo, dedicación. I'm not coming in and doing it my, just myself. It's really all about the community and everybody taking a stand and making sure they're getting what they need to go to school. Stepping in to help out financially is absolutely necessary and absolutely appreciated. <laughs>